Hey everybody, it's Carmen and welcome back to my channel. If you are a brand new sewer or like me, returning to sewing after a very long time, welcome. Hit that subscribe button below, touch that notification bell, and you will be on the VIP list next time I upload a brand new video. Today, it's a collaboration. I am doing a collaboration with Jen from Today in Jen's Sewing Room and Sharon from Sharon Sews. We collaborated on McCall's 7969. McCall 7969. We thought it would be fun to do the same pattern so that you could see what that pattern looks like on different body shapes. This dress was a real challenge. It really was. Uh, it was a challenge for me in, I don't know if it was the fit or the actual look of it. I, um, I have learned a lot in what I like to see and sew for myself just from this dress. But uh, it, was, it was fun collaborating with the ladies and uh, I'm glad that I did it. I did view A, I love the sleeves. This dress is described as very loose fitting. So, which should have been my first clue. Uh, based on the finished garment measurements, I cut a size small in the bodice, front, back, and sleeves, and then an extra small on the skirt. It goes together really easily. The uh, the neckline is done and the uh, sleeves are done with kind of like a bias binding uh, tape piece that they, they have you cut out. Uh, the fabric that I used was some free fabric that I got from Facebook Marketplace um, in that great big haul. I'll, I'll list that up here if you haven't seen that. There was a lot of great pieces that I got for free on Facebook Marketplace. It's very, very lightweight. So when I saw how uh, uh, oversized it was for me, I thought, you know what? It's gonna make a great bathing suit cover up for vacation. And that's actually, I'm wearing it as a bathing suit cover up. That's a bathing suit top that you see underneath there. Um, and then uh, Sharon had sent over a Pinterest picture where someone was wearing it with a wide belt. So I happened to pick up a couple of wide belts on Amazon a month or so ago for a few of the other makes that I made. And it seems to work out with that. I styled it with the sandals and the wide belt for after dinner or, you know, for going out to dinner after a day at the pool. I left it on after I took the pictures. The pic it seems to be growing on me. I, I seem to like it more and more so, and it's a pretty warm here today, so it's kind of nice to and breezy to be flowing around in, in at home. I probably won't make the dress again. Um, yeah, I, I probably won't make this dress again. And um, I think that what I've learned, and you know, I've talked about it before in a couple of, of the other videos, I, I feel like I do a little bit better with more fitted uh, sh shapes of garments. And um, I, I can tell you, I, I feel a little bit lost in this one. So that is McCall 7969. I can't wait to see their versions of, of the same dress. 
If you've made it, you know, comment below and tell me if you've made the dress. I'd love to hear from you. And I'd like to know which version you like. Do you like it loose and flowy or do you like it belted? Talk to you soon.